things off the bat one is somebody wrote into one of our reactions that pentatonix doesn't do covers they do upgrades 100 <laughs> percent, that's true and the other thing is that there's a there's an unheralded member of the group i feel like which is the videographer or whoever puts together the not to, you know the whoever has the creative vision for the videos i feel like mm -hmm. the videos are that was a great video that was it's so simple it, it was really captivating i really like how they did that my, my first thought when he was writing on the, the card mm -hmm. 
was, come on, you didn't just write that. that <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you hardly made any, any marks with your hand. And then all of a sudden, but then of course, you guys realized they weren't pretending to just write it. That was great. I, I, I love everything about it. I'll just keep talking for one second. That's by, okay. all, by all means. I used to love the lyrics of that song. Uh, and I just wanted to comment that, like when I was, I was saying to you before, I was bar mitzvah, and in the 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 haftorah portion where you talk about the the part of the Bible that that, you're, that you just read in Hebrew, and you're giving it in English, and I talked about, I I, I actually quoted the Imagine song as, a, wouldn't it be nice if we were living in this sort of utopia with no religion, no borders, no etc. And then the rabbi gave like a rebuttal to my speech. But I thought at the time, I, I thought it was such a, a wise song in a way, imagine. And now when I listen to it, I think it's not as wise as I thought it was back in the day. Like I, I feel like it's a bit naive in the sense that, you know, I, I think that people, humans, many of us need religion. We we do better with religion. We And, and I think we're seeing that as a society move away from religion and we move away from sort of a nuclear family, which I think is sort of tied to that. I think undoubtedly you see a degradation of the society, of culture, and uh, you know, I regret that. I, I, I feel sad about that. Now, the song is beautiful and it's an aspirational song, like you were saying, and I still appreciate it. And I think it's, you know, and, and, and their rendition of it is, I mean, just phenomenal, phenomenal. But I, you know, I think that there's something missing. I, I think the song misses, for me, with, you know, the benefit of another 30 years or so of more than that since my bar mitzvah of life i think that it's not it's not right that that we would be better off with no religion i think we are inherently religious and when there is no organized religion to fill that we find other things to fill that void in america right now a lot of people fill it with politics which is completely not healthy and i think you see that with how strongly identified people become with their political opinions it becomes like a religion to a lot of people and that's not healthy Interesting. Uh, well, first of all, I agree. Uh, beautiful, beautiful rendition. Amazing performance. Uh, really, a lot of a, a lot of depth to it. And once again, we are now appreciating the depth of it. Thank you. With the headphones. Um, I as as we started talking about Imagine just before we started recording, like you said, we had some disagreements, and I still have that disagreement because, like you said, uh, there is. I mean, that I that I said. I think it's. A, Aspiration, yeah. and as aspirational in a similar vein as, let's say, Plato had his Philosopher King. Philosopher King is sort of this ideal leader and ruler, which essentially is impossible. We know that it is a powerful, philosophical, wise, and uh, moral and ethical being, which in reality we cannot see. It just sure. is impossible. We don't see that. But it's aspirational for someone like that. And I think that if you take this literally, and if you take this, the, the lyrics literally, and you say no borders, no wars, and nothing like that, and we look around, we just look away from the lyrics and look around, right. no, no, that doesn't yeah, happen. Yeah. But why does it not happen? It doesn't happen because this xenophobia that is built into us by biology, some may say, and I agree with that, that when we were huddled in, in our hunter-gatherer tribes, we had to be afraid of others because- Back were times were good. Right? <laughs> Well, when, when we have to have that xenophobia and that xenophobia fades away when there is a common threat, right? Yeah. Which is why the false flag operations are successful when they actually occur because you unite people that are otherwise fractioned, right. you unite them behind the same cause sure. and all of a sudden you forget the differences and you yes. unite and you are as one. The one thing that I didn't understand and I really think and perhaps you can comment on my missing this. I I'll think I know. <laughs> <laughs> I think that when they were writing, to me initially it was sort of counterintuitive and counterproductive to the message of the song. LGBTQ, Jewish, Christian, man, woman, you're trying to be as one. No, but no, no but then they, I get it. Okay. I get it. I get it. I, I, and then like, initially, yes. I was like, "Whoa, yeah, what yeah, are you I doing?" Agree. I agree. Yeah, 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 yeah. And right. then, and then right. he's a human, right. and yes, and yes. it's it's somewhat similar to some. Um, I forget a futurist who said that if you look at Teslas, if you look at Teslas, you get enough Teslas in the in the row, and if especially if they're the same car, you take away this whole chasing after Joneses, right? You sure. everyone has the same car. Yeah. 
but then everyone will put a little thing on their car and once again you're starting to differentiate yourself and you're starting to 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 take away that that you have to put the best stuff that's the thing do what you have to put the best stuff on your car well, was... <laughs> <laughs> but you know what i mean like it's, yes it yes, takes yes, away yes, from yes. that well that's yeah that's human the reason why this is not a possible reality is because of human nature what you're just what you're saying is human nature will force you will have people start to put extra little things yeah. on their yeah. cars yeah, exactly. to differentiate themselves. There was a there was a, a Star Trek, <laughs> the first Star Trek, the real Star Trek, back in the day where there was a society where everyone looks exactly the same and it drives everyone kind of crazy because you know you need some you, some differentiation for yeah. humans. You know, yeah. it's too bad in some ways. I mean, look, it, it is it paints a perfect a picture of utopia, which but but of course the you know, the downfall of humanity, you might say, is chasing utopia, is, is not recognizing our limitations. And that's why we need guardrails. That's why a government needs checks and balances. That, that, that's what, you know, all, all, all of the things. Anyway, it's a beautiful song. Though. It's a beautiful song. And I think it's aspirational and aspiration is important. It's like, yeah. you don't want to take anything too concrete, too yeah. concrete or too, um, well, or, or too specific. Like if you are a Buddhist and you believe that you will not harm or kill anything and you accidentally step on the bug, yeah. you don't need to commit suicide right away because, or, or really continue to feel yeah feel terrible for the rest of your life you need to take these things in moderation yeah yeah i, I think if we can if, if the song is if we take it as a message of hey let's remember that we're all human and right. tear down those barriers then of course it resonates completely there's a real quick story one of the funniest story i forget who told me this or if it was even on tell oh, god i can't remember but they were talking about being in a buddhist temple and talking about life and you know everything, and they were spraying raid to kill the to kill the bugs. It's like what, what the what is what is that? Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Thanks for the recommendations. Again, we can't say it enough. Thanks for the headphones because that makes a huge difference. Please remember to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. It really helps us out with our YouTube algorithm, and we will see you in the next one.